Kevin said, what would you do to get to the path of 20K in profit in the shortest period of time with digital skills? Um, well, I mean, again, I'm a local SEO, so I would sell local SEO services or lead gen. And in the, in, in the, the, the shortest amount of time to get to profit is, again, it's not learning how to do the next, whatever the next shiny SEO method is. The, the quickest way to get to 20K in profit is to book as many goddamn sales calls as you can. Like that's, it's pretty simple. Book more sales calls, right? If you have digital skills, which you're saying, or somebody in your hypothetical question, whoever this person is, has digital skills. Okay. What about their sales skills, their marketing skills? What about that? Right. Turn on the marketing, book as many sales calls as you can. That's how you get to 20K. It's not the next SEO tactic. It's more sales calls. That's where the revenue comes from, right? So book more sales calls. And so learn marketing and sales. Pick an industry, get really good at that industry, know that industry better than the business owners. Now you're speaking their language. They look to you as an authority and you can sell the shit out of them. Yes, that takes time. Okay, so how would I do it very quickly? Well, I would find a, a really good offer and I would sell the shit out of that offer, right? That's how you do it. And, and so would it be a, a, a very complex offer? No, it would be a simple offer, something that was be easy to fulfill, or I would have a white label provider that could, could take scale, and meaning they, they could take as many orders as I could send to them and deliver them without it reducing quality or extending the time to delivery. I would find a white label provider that could fulfill a service that I could sell. I would wrap it up, package it up to make it a very compelling offer. And then I would sell the hell out of it. That's what I would do. And not recurring stuff. You're talking about, I mean, it can be a recurring offer, but a 20K in profit can be done with one-off sales, right? So again, directory hybrid agency, we've been working on an offer for months. I've tested it with multiple clients of mine and it works. And we're selling a $1,000. Well, we're testing with recommended retail pricing is $9.99. It's a one-off service. We call it brand builder. It achieves significant results within 30 days. And I can provide a money back guarantee on it. My white label fulfillment cost to fulfill that service are $529. Our recommended retail price is $9.99. It's a one-off, not a recurring. And we can guarantee results. We're also testing, starting to, we'll be testing $14.99 and $19.99 is the sales price to see if we can convert just as many or close to as many and increase profitability by making that same sale. That's a one-off sale, not recurring. If I sold that to 20 people, well, minus the fulfillment costs, I would have to sell it to what, 30 people, 30, 30 contractors. So I would pick a market, I would learn that market, and then I would develop a marketing and sales pitch to that market, to one market, one industry. And then I would start selling, start booking sales calls. And every time you get on another sales call with that, with the business owner in that specific industry, you get better and you get better and you get better. And after doing that enough times, it'll be like almost autopilot. You'll be able to close them because you'll anticipate objections before they even voice them. And again, guys, that's how you make money in SEO. Not learning the Ask SEO tactic. I'm not here to convince anybody not to learn SEO. Fine, learn SEO, great. I love SEO. But you don't make money from learning the next tactic. Unless you're in affiliate marketing and stuff like that, fine. But we're talking about local SEO. Local SEO, you got to provide results for your clients, but where does the money come from? Selling the service. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So sell, sell, sell. That's the point. Um, I swear to God, we're going to transition away from being mostly SEO training to mostly sales for SEO training, because that's where I think most people struggle. Um, you spend all your time learning. I'm not talking about you, Danny, but spend all your time learning the next SEO tactic. Never spend enough time monetizing it, right? In the local SEO space, you see that all the time. Well, I've got to learn this next move, this next, this next SEO method before I can sell. Then they learn that one. And then it's the next SEO method that they have to learn before. As soon as I learn this one, I'm going to crush it. And it's, a, it's like a dog chasing its tail. Never ends, right? Sell, sell, sell. That's how you make money. Hopefully that's clear. Um, guys, I, I'm only saying that from personal experience. Um, I mean, I've always done well in SEO. Uh, it's been a good industry to me for sure. Um, and I love it. I have a, an absolute passion for it. Um, but it wasn't until I got over kind of and, and, and learned about the, uh, the importance of selling and, under, and learning a market. Like 
again, I, I talked about this at POFU Live, and I'll repeat this again and again. Mark Cuban said, um, when you walk into a room full of business owners in a particular industry, if you don't know more about their business, their customers, their pain all, than they do, somebody like me is going to walk into the room and kick your ass. And so, and he's right. The point is, you go, and when you understand a market, a particular industry, you can become like a trusted advisor. And then again, because of repetition and constantly refining your marketing, your pitch, everything else, you get better and better and better at selling and closing which generates more revenue. And once I finally, finally grasped that concept, it changed everything for me, absolutely everything. And I mean that. Um, again, SEO has always been good to me, but boy, is it much better now. And it's because I learned how to sell, right? So, and that's all I'm trying to say, guys. I, I really want to encourage more of you guys to get into that mindset. Like, again, learn all the SEO you want. That's fine. But take care of your cash flow needs first. Do that first, right? Anyway, that's my advice. Um, stop struggling, make money instead. So.